Absolutely. Congressman Ron Paul is surging into second place in many national polls, showing his growing appeal. The Paul campaign is also claiming that it is winning the race for delegates. The campaign is confident it will pick up pluralities of delegates in caucus states like Iowa, Colorado, Nevada, and Minnesota. Question, is Congressman Paul winning? Joining me now to discuss is GOP strategist, good friend of the show, Jack Berkman. Jack, it's always a pleasure. Welcome Your here. Your Honor, pleasure here. Let me uh, put to you the same question I just put uh, to Doug Schoen. Can Ron Paul win the nomination without finishing first in any of the nominating processes, whether they are closed primaries where only Republicans can vote, open primaries where anybody can vote, or caucuses? Uh, yes. And I think he's, you know, you're already seeing him surge in national polls. I'll tell you what I think is very likely. I'll make you a bold prediction, Judge. I'll make a bold prediction right here and now following what we've been saying for a year. Ron Paul is going to be on the Republican ticket. And I'll tell you why. I'll back that up. Last night establishes you now have four people who have the momentum to take this to the convention. Santorum's in. Gingrich is in. Romney and Paul are definitely in. Four bodies are going to the convention. What that means is, and this goes into what I've argued for six months, we're going to see a brokered convention. The vote will be split up such that they will have to make a deal. The likely leader will be Romney, but he won't have enough, he won't have enough delegates to win. Here's All right, what let, happens. Let me, let me stop yeah. you, Jack. Are you telling me that it is not just fanciful, but it may actually happen that the name Paul is on the national ticket, maybe not in the first place. I'm go yeah, not, maybe not in the first place. I'm going further than that. I am now affirmatively predicting that Ron Paul will be on the ticket. I'll lay odds. If this were in London, Judge, I'd lay odds. We can, we can lay odds on this. this. I'm saying this will likely happen, and here's why. Go ahead. If the, when the vote is split up, let's say Romney gets 900 to Gingrich 600, Santorum 500, Paul 450, something like that. Romney will look at the field, and he will have to pick one of them as the VP in order to get the nomination. Gingrich and Santorum have extremely high negatives in a general election. Nobody in their right mind would want them on the ticket. Both of them, the negatives are so sky high. Got I mean, Santorum, uh, you got to go. Who's left? It's Ron a, Paul. It's a and, and, bold. It's a bold prediction, Jack. I'm but not I, surprised to hear it from you. It's utterly tantalizing. We we have to go. Thank you for joining us. We'll pick up on this the next time you're with us. Thank you, Judge. Appreciate it. You're welcome. The revolution continues right here.